what is going on YouTube my name is Gadus and today I'm going to be showing you how to fix Batman Arkham Knight's FPS issue I'm going to be showing you how to get a better performance boost for the overall game so like most people have been having an optimization issue for Batman Arkham Knight it's really really slow and it's not slow because I have a bad rig I have 16 gigs of RAM, two R9-290X graphics cards, which are more than enough to run this game at high to medi medium settings. But I just found out that it's not just me, it's a lot of people that ha are having this issue. So after going online and scouring the internet to find solutions to this problem, I found a really weird and uh, basic solution for the problem and that is what I'm going to show you today so the first thing that you want to do well this part applies for uh, AMD users but if you have an Nvidia graphics card just wait and um, the part that applies to you will come so bear with me here alright so the first thing AMD users wants to do is just download the version 5.6 beta driver you can find it in the uh, in their website. I'll put a link in the description. Uh, and then just manually enter your graphics card and download the driver. So once you download the driver, what you want to do is if your P FPS is locked to 30, you can change that in in your folder. So open your Steam folder. Uh, go to Steam Apps, Common, Batman Arkham Knight, VM Game config and then open the BM system settings so if that seems a little confusing to you I will put it down in the description so you can find it easily so after you open that settings you can tweak as much of the settings that you, as you want so so change the max FPS to 60 and then if you have two AMD um, graphics cards and you have Crossfire enabled, you can enable that by um, going to B, enable Crossfire false in the BM system settings sections. So um, in order to make this easy to find, I'm just gonna uh, press Control F and just search for Crossfire. So there it is. So um, just enable that. I already set it to true before. So uh, yours should be false. But you should only do this if you have Crossfire integration. So um, after you enable that, save the file and close everything up. So one of the most important things that made the biggest difference in this game is playing it in windowed mode. So once you launch the game, you would see a really big difference when you're playing it in full screen and in windowed, in windowed mode, no matter what graphics driver you have. So this is the fix, this is the weird fix that I found by running through forums and uh, reading a lot of comments from people who've tried different things and if you just run the game in windowed mode you would see a significant difference in performance so if you follow all the steps correctly this will definitely boost your FPS rate personally it really amped up my FPS and the game was actually enjoyable as a result of me being able to play it <laughs> so uh, I uh, this is a temporary fix and uh, I hope it helps and I hope the devs actually release a fix for the game as soon as possible and just stating the obvious unoptimized releasing unoptimized games is really harmful not just for the developers but for the series as well so this is not the first unoptimized game that was ever released <coughs> um, Assassin's Creed Unity was another one which really hurt the uh, series as a whole so um, if you uh, liked the video please like and uh, share it to
people who are having this issue and um, I hope it helps them as well alright so thanks for watching and um, enjoy the game